Hi. Hello. We're all left out, and this is mychristianfilms.org. <laughs> Uh, my name is Yona, I play bass guitar in All Left Out. Um, my name's Ken and I play guitar and sing in All Left Out. So same, ba same band as he's in. So. <laughs> That's convenient, that yeah. works mm. well together. Yeah. Sometimes <laughs> we like share the stage that, together. That helps, yeah. I'm sure also for the stages. audience. The audience probably enjoys that there's more than one of you up there. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's convenient for the venue because they usually only have one stage. So. Yeah, I would imagine that would be well well working to the whole outcome purpose. Yeah. Um, how many band How many band members do you guys actually have? Because there's two of you here, but yeah. there's a couple um, others. We have four all together. So we have a drummer and a guitarist who are out shopping at the moment. Are they? Yes. At Guitar Center. <laughs> you guys are not from the States. Where are you from? Uh, we're from New Zealand and we tour mostly in the States. Yeah, we've been a band for seven and a half, seven and a half years and I guess Ken started it so you can talk How did about you it start you. it? Um, well, I was playing drums in another band and I was writing songs as well and um, and I kind of wanted to start something different where I could sing my own songs rather than having someone else sing them. Mm. Um, so that's basically why we started, why I started the band. So how did you end up finding all of the band members? How did you guys get together? Um, well, this is not the original lineup. Um, we, um, we kind of, the New Zealand music scene is quite small. Mm -hmm. And so we played, my old band played shows with a lot of other bands that were in the same kind of music scene and um, yeah we just kind of like formed out of out of people from different bands and stuff like that so yeah. so you guys met on the road and then just kind of all came together and collaborated yeah. and well you can't really call it on the road in New Zealand because <laughs> everything like just bands that you play with you know like gotcha. well you can't really I mean the longest tour you can do in New Zealand is like a week or two if you're lucky right so. <laughs> yeah. So, well, that sorry, that's no. kind of why we're in the states because we wanted to do it full time, and we can't. You can't really sustain mm. like a regular income or anything mm. um, in New Zealand, let alone the states. Being a musician. So, do do you have fans in New Zealand or people who know who you are? Yep. Right on. Uh, there's quite a big Christian festival that we play there mm -hmm. every year, and. I guess that's where most people see us, and apart from that, we do our own tours, but they normally last two weeks at the most. So you guys have been here this year since May, you said? Yeah. So where have you, um, where have you covered as far as you know, touring throughout the state since May? Basically everywhere. We spent a few months in Canada as well, awesome. but we've done kind of the national circuit, and then this tour has just been predominantly east sort of east coast ish east coast so, yeah you guys are heading out after today all the way to the west coast right um yeah yeah in a couple of days we're driving from jacksonville across to la and is that where you and, and you're heading home from there from yeah. la do you yeah. get to do any um any playing between here and la or no it's just a straight drive just a straight that's yeah. a long yeah. drive. got a plane to catch so we can't really <laughs> stick around and look at waterfalls or anything. I gotcha, gotcha. But you've been in the States, you said, for how many years that you've been coming back here? Uh, since 2005. Oh, wonderful. So, yeah, I think we've been to every state except for Maine and Alaska and Hawaii. Oh, you haven't done Hawaii yet? Ah, you gotta go to Hawaii. Yeah, I'd like to. <laughs> I've always wanted to go to Hawaii. Actually. Yeah, you got to. There's mm. tons of um, Polynesians, so if you're used to Polynesians from New Zealand, you'll yep. see lots of them there. I do lots of surfing back home, so ah, I'd see? definitely love to go there. I'd say that should be on the agenda for next year. Yep. <laughs> Try it'll be on the agenda, I don't know if it'll be on the budget. <laughs> I got yeah, you. It's always on the agenda. It's always on there, just whether it yeah. happens or not, right? Yeah. So tell us a little bit about your music. What is the kind of, um, well, what style would you say your music is? Um, we're kind of like power pop, mm -hmm. I guess. Um, so it's rock, but it's it's got a pop kind of edge to it, if you like. Like it's melodic, but um, 
but there's you know like guitars and stuff obviously. So. Awesome. So what what inspires you to write some of your songs? Um, life experiences, um, like our faith as Christians and stuff, mm -hmm. and um, just the things that we go through and. Um, yeah, um, I guess in the last few years, like touring and, um, you know, just the sacrifice and stuff that it takes to follow your dreams has become like a big inspiration to us. Mm. Also, I guess the more you travel around the world and the people that you meet, um, and I guess the more you see God's um, goodness everywhere, and uh, so that inspires us a lot. Like the last album was mostly inspired by love. Mm -hmm. So, and then just love mixed with experiences around the world, both good and bad. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So how have you seen God, um, God's hand moving in opening doors and opportunities for you over the past, gosh, five years that you've been stateside doing this? Um, well, we're still alive for a start. <laughs> we haven't had an income for about five years, so the fact that we can still tour around. Wow. Um, all the money we make is just through selling CDs mm -hmm. and so I guess in a sense God has opened up a door just for us to be here because uh, it's hard to get uh, working visas mm -hmm. if you're not a big uh, famous band so he's opened doors that way and then I guess we've just met thousands of people all over that have accommodated us and helped us out in some way. Awesome. Uh, and yeah, I guess um, changed our lives. The um, group that we toured with in Canada, they do a lot of humanitarian trips mm -hmm. to Dominican Republic, uh, Mexico and Thailand. Wow. And they go to Haiti as well. And so that opened our eyes quite a bit to another side of poverty and slavery, mm. which we'd never seen before. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah. So you guys are true missionaries in the pursuit of of sharing your music with the world mm. as well. So yep. it's not just, you know, it's not just about the music in the sense of, you know, yay, we're singers. It's it's really a mission, a mission field for you guys. Yeah, like I, I guess I guess <laughs> we're not we're definitely not living in luxury or anything. <laughs> um, so yeah, definitely there's like sacrifices and stuff. I think uh, like in comparison to some other people we have it pretty easy but mm. um, but it's also, in a sense, not easy, <laughs> you know. Um, but we feel like we're called to do it and we love doing it, so awesome. we'll keep doing it as long as we feel God's calling us to do it. Awesome. Yeah. Well, um, where can people get a hold of your CDs? Do you guys have a website or anything? Uh, yeah, um, it's allleftout.com. Okay. Um, we have uh, the MySpace is all left out NZ like okay. for New Zealand. Uh -huh. word. And we also have Facebook, and all of our music is on for sale on iTunes. Awesome. And um, most major online music stores. This is All Left Out, and their newest album is We're Alive. And you can, you heard it from them, you can find it on iTunes, you can find it on their Facebook, their MySpace, and allleftout.com.